Hello everyone, how are you all? So the Galaxy S8 may be the most stylish Samsung phone to buy right now, but that may not be the situation in 2018. A successor called the Galaxy S9 is coming and we are already excited. There's still a lot I don't know about the Samsung next flagship, but pieces of the puzzle are slowly coming together. Here's everything I think I could tell you about this device. So what will be the Galaxy S9 look like? Rather like the Galaxy S8, according to most rumors. A render posted on Twitter supposedly showing the Galaxy S9 reveals a vertically stacked camera lens and fingerprint sensor on the rear. And it is flanked by a flash unit and other sensors. The front shows similarly side bezels above and below the screen to the Galaxy S8, a USB type port C and a 3.5mm headphone jack can be spotted on the bottom of the phone. If a leaked image of the packaging for the Galaxy S9 is correct, it also appears that the phone will retain its IP68 rating. Now talking about its camera, the Galaxy S8's camera is great but it is overshadowed by the competition and eventually by Galaxy Note 8. What will Samsung do for Galaxy S9? Rumors point to the Galaxy S9 having a single rear camera and the Galaxy S9 Plus having a dual lens camera. Rumors persist based on the renders of the phone that Samsung may add a dual sensor shooter to the Galaxy S9 similar to the way Apple differentiates between the iPhone 8 and iPhone 8 Plus. And Samsung is working on a sensor capable of shooting 1000 frames per second according to a new report. It's expected to enter a mass production in November, months ahead of the Galaxy S9's rumored release date, leaving plenty of time for Samsung to incorporate it into the design. Packaging for the Galaxy S9 first leaked on Reddit seemed to confirm a super slow-mo feature as well. Now you could see some Samsung Galaxy S9's box, some features that is showing that contains 8 megapixel selfie camera, uh, IP68 water and dual resistant features, average scanner, 64 GB memory and 4 GB of RAM. And how will you unlock your Galaxy S9 and keep the information on it secure? Both a fingerprint sensor and iris scanner are rumored for inclusion. Samsung may be improving the iris scanner for Galaxy S9 over the one provided on Galaxy S8. An anonymous source speaking to the Korea Herald said the iris camera lens will be increased from 2 megapixels to 3 megapixels for the S9, helping it recognize faces in more challenging environments, and also when the eyes move during scanning or the behind glasses. The improved iris scanning capabilities appear to be confirmed at a recent press release from Samsung. And now you could see the leaked back panel of Samsung Galaxy S9. Uh, for those who were hoping the Galaxy S9 would launch with Android OG 8.1, you may be out of your luck. A report from XD developers states the S9 will ship with Android OG 8.0. A report from the Netherlands based Android Club seems to confirm this rumor and attributes the delay to the addition of Samsung Experience Interface. And here you could see the specs of Samsung Galaxy S9. It would have 4GB of RAM or 6GB and the storage would be 64, 128 or 256 GB variant. And the camera would be 12 megapixel dual pixel camera with optical image stabilization of f1.5 and f2.4 aperture and it would be you know having Bixby artificial intelligent assistant also with a dedicated button and it will have IP68 water and dust resistant and the release date is expected in February or March 2018 so that's all for now for the Galaxy S9 thanks for watching